What up, Nerd Nation? This is Nerd Boy Rob, and he's very excited to be opening his first nerd block. This is the month of November. I actually already used my trusty zombie knife here. So, I haven't looked yet. Let's take a look. Let's see if I can even open this. Now, I know everyone always does. I've watched these before. Everyone always does the t-shirt last. So, let's see what we got here first. This is some kind of stuffed guy. This is... This is... Robin. This bag is not a toy, Robin. Not really sure. So I'm guessing we have some kind of heroes. Maybe a sidekicks theme for November. It actually doesn't look like any Robin I know. Looks more like the uh, ambiguous uh, gay duo. Robin, maybe. Let's see what else we got. That's from Saturday Night Live, too, by the way, before anyone sends me any uh, weird uh, comments or anything. I don't know what this is, but I really like it. This is a uh, Pokemon watch? No. This is Nerd Block Soft Watch. I am a huge watch fan. This is awesome. It looks like some kind of ghost. Let's see if it says anything on there. Setting time, changing batteries, nothing. Just a nerd block slap watch. That's alright, man. I love watches. I might even sport that tomorrow. I feel some other stuff here in the box. Again, I'm keeping. Whoa! Trying to keep all this nerd block stuff a shock and a surprise. Dude. Dude. Really? I love Star Wars stuff. If you've already been checking out my other reviews, you can tell I love Star Wars stuff. Stickers, I'm not a huge fan of. But Star Wars, yeah. I can put them on my car. I don't know if I'd be the coolest guy, but I'd have stickers on my car. Boba Fett, the rebel symbol, or it's not the rebel symbol, the uh, bounty hunter symbol. Actually, nice quality to these stickers. All right, let's see what else we got here. Oh, I think I feel more stickers, maybe. Let's see here. Nerd Block Certificate of Authenticity. Document certifies that the print you received in your November 2014 Nerd Block is an authentic signature from Bruce Campbell. Wow, nice. Bruce Campbell Horror Fest. That is pretty freaking cool. Bruce Campbell Horror Fest signature. That in itself is pretty awesome. I would have expected that maybe in the October Nerd Block, which I did not get. Nice. Let's see, I know there's a shirt. Oh wait, I feel something more in this Nerd Block. So I feel a couple things. Let's see here. Warwick Davis or Val Kilmer, along with other great toys and collectibles, Nerd Block. The December everywhere every subscriber is guaranteed an autograph of Willow print by Warwick Davis or Val Kilmer. Oh, interesting. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. Let's see what else. Oh, here's what's inside. I don't really want to read that. Holy plush toy Batman. So I could have gotten Batman or Robin, and I got Robin. I can definitely say from looking at Robin and Batman, it's kind of weird that Batman is smaller, and Robin has a huge head. Robin's on the Balco, I guess. Balco. Alright, let's see what else we got here. Just 
know there's a shirt. Everyone does the shirt last, but I'm going to do something crazy. Oh, I'm going to do the shirt next to last. It's, I can tell it's Deadpool. And I love Deadpool. He's one of my favorite characters. Set here. Set my uh, camera up on my makeshift stand. And I can tell you already that this is a shirt that I will sport. Bang, bang, bang. Dude, anything that has Deadpool on it is cool. I got the extra large. I'm thinking I might change it to a large. Usually I always buy a large in the stores and I'm like, man, it's going to shrink. I should have bought the extra large. Then I return it. But here I'm thinking I should have gotten the large, but I don't know. I'll have to try it on later. I'm already pretty happy, and there's actually one more thing left in this nerd block. I'm guessing it's some kind of mug. Let's see what I do with that zombie knife. I have to say... This Bruce Campbell signature, or yeah, Bruce Campbell authentic signature, is the highlight. Using my zombie knife. Uh, maybe I should open the top here. Oh, it definitely is a mug. Definitely is a mug. The Invincible Iron Man mug. Nice. I don't drink coffee. I don't drink hot chocolate. I rarely drink tea. But you know what? The Invincible Iron Man mug is pretty cool. Oh, nice. I didn't even see the detail on the back there. I gotta say, for my first nerd block, I am very excited. Just a quick review of everything I got. Iron Man mug? Eh. Will I use it? No. Will I keep it? Yes. Some kind of... You know, I keep thinking he's a Pokemon, but maybe he's a Mario Brothers. Uh, Ghost. Slap watch. Look at that. Love the watch. Man, I wish I got the Batman, but I ended up getting the Robin. I don't know if I'm going to keep the Robin. At my uh, my work, I actually started a, uh, a uh, Toys for Tots in the community. So I think Robin's going to go into it. Why not? The more, the merrier. I'm also adding some other toys to that, so... This kind of tells you what I think is coming out next month. Warwick Davis or Val Kilmer. I could really care less on either one. Bounty Hunter. Boba Fett. Star Wars stickers. Awesome. Anything Star Wars is just awesome. But the highlight for me. Not using my zombie knife. The highlight for me. Bruce Campbell. Signature. I probably will get this framed, actually. So again, I gotta say, for my first nerd block, oh yeah, I almost forgot. The uh, king of death, Deadpool here. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, one more. Bang. Very awesome. I will sport the shirt. Like I said, I'll have to try it on. I always buy an extra large because it shrinks, but I actually think the extra large might be a little big, so I might trade it to large. 
That's just my own personal opinion. But for my first nerd block, freaking awesome. I cannot wait for December's. So, Nerd Nation, thank you for sticking with this long review for me. And uh, I'll actually put a nerd block um, feed or whatever they call it so you guys can find this too. Have a great night and thanks for watching. Bye.